Welcome to my passion travel channel and I invite you I make content on tourism and subscribe to my channel and put a little like. Porta Plata Porta Plata is a city located in the northern coast of the Dominican Republic, in the province of Porta Plata. It is a popular tourist destination known for its beautiful beaches, scenic landscapes, and historic landmarks. The city was founded in the late 19th century, and it has since become one of the most important economic and cultural centers in the region. It is home to a variety of attractions, including the Fort of San Felipe, the Amber Museum, and the Bruegel Rum Distillery. Porta Plata is also known for its beautiful beaches, such as Playa Dorada, Sasua Beach, and Cabaret Beach, which offer a range of water sports activities, including snorkeling, diving, and windsurfing. The city is also surrounded by beautiful natural landscapes, including the Isabel de Torres National Park and the Damajagua Waterfalls. Overall, Porta Plata is a beautiful and diverse destination that offers something for everyone, the Basilica of Higüe. The Basilica of Higüe, also known as the Basilica Nuestra Señora de la Altagracia, is a Catholic basilica located in the city of Higüe in the eastern region of the Dominican Republic. It is considered one of the most important religious sites in the country and is dedicated to the Virgin Mary. The basilica was built in the mid-20th century and is a blend of Gothic and modern architecture. It was designed by the French architect André-Jacques Dunoyer de Sagonzac, and its construction was funded by the donations of the local people. The Basilica of Higüe is home to the statue of the Virgin Mary known as Nuestra Señora de la Altagracia, which is considered the patron saint of the Dominican Republic. The statue is a small wooden image of the Virgin Mary and is believed to have been brought to the island by Spanish colonizers in the 16th century. Every year, on January 21, thousands of people from all over the country gather at the Basilica for the Feast of Our Lady of Altagracia. It is a major religious festival that includes processions, masses, and other festivities that honor the patron saint of the Dominican Republic. Montana Redonda Montana Redonda is a scenic hill located in the Dominican Republic. It is situated near the town of Michis in the eastern region of the country. The hill is known for its breathtaking views of the surrounding landscape, including the lush green forests, rolling hills, and the nearby coast. Visitors to Montana Redonda can enjoy a range of activities, including hiking, horseback riding, and ziplining. The hill is also a popular spot for taking photos and enjoying the scenery. At the top of the hill, there is a viewing platform where visitors can take in the panoramic views. Montana Redonda is a relatively new tourist attraction in the Dominican Republic, but it has quickly become a popular destination for both locals and tourists. Its unique natural beauty and range of activities make it an ideal spot for those looking to explore the natural wonders of the Dominican Republic. Los Hadesis National Park Los Hadesis National Park is a protected area located in the northeastern region of the Dominican Republic. It is known for its stunning landscapes, including limestone cliffs, mangrove forests, and stunningly clear waters. The park is home to a diverse range of flora and fauna, including several species of birds, bats, and reptiles. Los Hadesis National Park is a popular destination for ecotourists and nature lovers, who come to explore the park's natural beauty and diverse wildlife. Visitors can take boat tours to explore the park's mangrove forests and coastal caves, which are home to pre-Columbian pictographs and petroglyphs. The park is also a popular spot for hiking and birdwatching. In addition to its natural beauty, Los Hadesis National Park is also an important cultural and historical site. The park's caves and rock formations were used by the indigenous Taino people, who left behind a rich legacy of art and artifacts. The park was also an important site for the Spanish during the colonial era, as it provided a natural harbor and a source of timber for shipbuilding. Overall, Los Hadesis National Park is a must-visit destination for anyone interested in the natural beauty and rich history of the Dominican Republic. Las Turinas Las Turinas is a town located on the northeastern coast of the Dominican Republic, in the Samama province. It is known for its beautiful beaches, lively atmosphere, and diverse international community. 
The town has a mix of Dominican and European cultures and offers a range of activities, including water sports, hiking, and horseback riding. The most popular beaches in Las Torinas are Playa Bonita, Playa Cosan, and Punta Popi. The town is also home to a variety of restaurants, bars, and shops that cater to both locals and tourists. Altos de Chavon Altos de Chavon is a cultural village located in La Romana, Dominican Republic. It was designed in the late 1970s by Italian architect Roberto Coppa to resemble a 16th-century Mediterranean village. The village sits atop a hill overlooking the Chavon River and features cobblestone streets, stone buildings, and a central plaza. Altos de Chavon is known for its cultural and artistic attractions, including the Altos de Chavon School of Design, which was founded in 1983 in partnership with the Parsons School of Design in New York City. The school offers courses in design, architecture, fine arts, and photography, among other subjects. The village also features a number of galleries, shops, restaurants, and a 5,000-seat amphitheater that has hosted performances by famous musicians such as Frank Sinatra, Elton John, and Shakira. Altos de Chavon is a popular tourist destination and a unique example of cultural preservation and innovation in the Dominican Republic.